Create AI powered mini courses in just minutes with Mini Course Generator from AppSumo. And today we're going to take a look at Mini Course Generator, a $79 lifetime deal. Now, this gives you 30 mini courses, 5 gigabytes of storage, 3 AI powered mini course generations per month. You can stack one code to get unlimited mini courses. Two codes gives you 35 gigabytes of storage. Now, one of the negatives, and there are some negatives to this tool, one of them is you have to stack a code for that unlimited mini course and the payment wall with Stripe integration. So let's jump into the tool. I'm going to go ahead and create a course. We'll give it a title. We'll call it the demo course. And this is the interface for generating mini courses fast. Now I'll show you the AI assistant generated courses here in a little bit, but first and foremost, we have the info tab. And if I click any of these here, like I'll click info, it's gonna add another card. On the card, I can add an image for the video. I can upload my own content. Here we see I can do 25 megabytes, MP4s, JPEGs, PNGs, GIFs, Whatever file you need to upload, you can do it right here. I'll go ahead and add one that I've uploaded in the past. You can also paste a YouTube link, and that can be an unlisted video or a public video. You can add jiffies, unsplash photos, and you can embed within. So let me say video lesson one. I'm going to go ahead and highlight this text. We can make this header one, header two, or paragraph. We can bold, underline, and italicize it and we can jump into the code view. So inside this code, we can actually jump into an old AppSumo deal. I made a video on called Killer Player, and Killer Player lets you do like Wistia or Vimeo, all that type of stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and quickly customize this. You can embed things like Killer Player into Mini Course Generator in this code function. So I'm gonna go ahead and paste that in there, and let's go ahead and click there, and there is our Killer Player video. Now, one thing I'll point out is this embed code and the way that it shows up here. If I actually preview this, this card, you'll see up here at the top, this one's hosted through Mini Course Generator, and the second one is through Killer Player. However, again, you can paste YouTube and you get the full screen support. I don't know if I would embed videos in there because currently this isn't full screen supported, but I do think that's a nice feature. And what I would love to see is the ability to embed up here at the top through something other than just YouTube. Like if you could just drop the embed from Killer Player up there, then I'm going to get a more customized branded type experience using YouTube to host the videos, all of those amazing things. But let's keep going. We have quiz functionality with Mini Course Generator. Over here, we can do a single answer quiz or a multiple answer. And I'm going to go ahead with single right here. We'll type in our question. Have you liked the video? We'll jump onto Jiffy. We'll give it a thumbs up. We'll go with yes. And I am right now. We'll give them two choices. I'm going to click right there to give that as the proper answer. Now I can import all options here if I had a bunch of different options. I could go ahead and do that and then it would all add right there. If I'm deleting out, I'm going to go to import all options. I'm going to just delete like that and then I come back and then we're good to go. So all of that is very easy. It's super quick to build quizzes. Again, multi-select or single answer. If you do the multiple answers, then you can select multiple correct answers. Again, depending on your needs, you can do open-ended. So you could say, what is your name? That can be like the open-ended. You start the uh, quiz off with something like that. And then the users are going to answer in a free text format. Then we can do surveys. We can do a star rating. Let's go ahead and add that. How did we do? And I'll show you real quick at the end of the video how I think you can use this to get around one of the things that they currently don't have. And then under surveys, we also have the ability for single select, multi-select, or a numeric input. So I could say on a scale of one to 10, how am I doing? And we'll go ahead and put the max value as 10. Now gateways, we can put a sign up here. So let's go ahead and put enter your email to access the course. We'll drag this all the way to the front. I don't like that I can't drag and just hold and bring it all the way over. That would be really nice. I do have to use kind of a back and forth. And then the last thing would be gateways. They do have the Stripe paywall. I can go ahead and add that here. Click this icon down here, put it in test mode or live mode, connect it to Stripe, and I could actually make some money off of my mini courses. So down here on any given tag, we can go ahead and add a link and say YouTube channel. This is a URL, but I could also do PDF, video, or image. Let's add a URL for the YouTube channel. Then I'll come back here and let's add a video. 
We'll do a video called mini course. So like I just picked up this book called zero to 100K IG followers. And let's go ahead and add this PDF there. So it's rather easy to add again, URLs, PDFs, videos, images, anything like that. And it's going to show up as supplemental material. Now let's go ahead and preview our mini course. I'll go ahead and enter in my email address name. And then we've got video lesson one. Again, this is the embed here. But what I want to show you is you can embed stuff. You might have to play around with the iframes because that's what it's doing. Up here at the top is the video that's hosted by them. I could easily paste a YouTube video in. I'm, I've actually done that for this mini course here on Cheat Layer. Down here at the bottom, we have our YouTube channel, a mini course. And then if I click the PDF, it'll open up the PDF. Instagram zero to 100K. If you want to grow on Instagram, this book, I'm like 300 pages in right now. And it is just insanely valuable. But I digress. If I go over here, have you liked the video yet? Let's see. Oh, nope, I got it wrong. So let's keep going. And on a scale of one to 10, how am I doing? You're doing a 20, Scott. Well, it it defaulted us back to 10 because that was the max that we did. We'll give it a five. And then here, how did we do? Five stars all the way. That's our mini course. We just created it. Now, what I want to show you next is how we can do the AI assistant. But before we do that, if you want to share this, you can share it with social sharing buttons or an embed code. And you can use this iframe generator if you're having some embed issues. I've had some embed issues as I embed theirs. And it is smart to go through this iframe generator and kind of get your sizing right and everything else. You know, I would like to see better embedding on their behalf, just integrations in general, it's missing integrations, but that is the tool in a nutshell. So if we jump back out to the home under analytics, it's going to download a report in Excel. And I don't like that one bit. And here's our analytics for what we just did. Have you liked the video? I can see that I got it wrong. I can see that I gave it a five. And then I also gave us a five stars. To me, the analytics should be is a part of the software with an option to download an Excel report as well. I don't like that one bit. I really think they need built-in analytics, especially for the price point that it's at. And if the tool were to scale and get better, I also think that they obviously have to figure out the web hooks and stuff like that so that they can pass along. I mean, if we're gonna gate this with an email address, we need to plug that into the autoresponder you know, without doing it manually. And that stuff is on the roadmap. I'll show you real briefly inside the roadmap. They're working on web hooks. They're working on some new layout options and card improvements, customizing your thank you page. Now you can easily do that. Let me show you how I've got a thank you page built in. And you can also add a favicon if you use a tool like Switchy. That is something that you can do. Otherwise though, I think this stuff should be built in. So on this mini course, I'll just tab through it real quick. I'm showing you like different texts throughout. And then I've got my affiliate links, which I actually need to change this and add the link button down here. I think that would look a lot better than that because that's not a clickable link. I kind of thought it would be, but I didn't go through and make it clickable. So that's on me. But this is the last page right here, the end. And here's sign up for the AI Profits email list. And this is a Synfox embed that I put on it, as well as a, an ability to rate the course. So that is only sending to an Excel sheet right now. I can't view the analytics any other way. The analytics is a weak part of this tool, in my opinion, in its current fashion. Let's jump into the AI Assistant, where we're going to create a few different types of content using their artificial intelligence. So let's get started with their example, Advantages of Mini Courses for Lead Generation. I can use up to 80 credits to describe what I wanted to do. And let's go ahead and create our first AI assisted mini course. So this is the AI assisted mini course. Looks like they brought some pictures in here and I'm not that impressed, but it is a framework that we can then go in and we can actually add to. So all they've done here is bring in some pictures, bring in some text on different slides. And then at the end, what are the main disadvantages of mini course? What are the main advantages of mini course? They tell me exactly what the answers are. I mean, it's okay. It's definitely, it's definitely not like something I can just do and then launch. Now I'm going to have to go through this and modify. And this was using the example that they actually recommend. Now I'm going to go back out. I do like that it saves things automatically. This time we're going to create a different AI powered mini course. How to start an affiliate marketing business in 2022 using YouTube is our topic. Let's go ahead and generate the mini course and let's see if it does any better with iteration number two. 
So it is done. Let's actually jump through. Affiliate marketing is a type of marketing where a business rewards one another. All right, so it tells us what affiliate marketing, it, and it does the same thing. So we're gonna have to create our own things. And then this one doesn't even give us a quiz at the end. So at this point, this is a very cool idea. I don't wanna like trash the idea. Very cool idea, the execution, it's got a ways to go. Let's just leave it at that. We're gonna say creating content using artificial intelligence for social media and beyond. And we're gonna generate a mini course for that. And the results here, artificial intelligence branch of computers. All right, so I don't even like the AI, what it's spitting out there. Like we kind of know what AI is, don't we? I mean, I guess maybe a micro course is introducing a subject uh, to someone that who doesn't know. But if we go through, this one's only given us eight slides. We do have a couple of quizzes here. What's the name of the branch of computer science that deals with creating machines, artificial intelligence? What does AI have to do with social media? It creates content on social media sites. So to wrap it up, I think Mini Course Generator has a ton of positives. It's an amazingly simple way to create fast mini courses, drive higher leads. You can sell them. You can do all of those fun things. However, there are definitely some things holding this deal back, most notably the limitations, the fact that it's $79 instead of, I would price this something in the $49 range, the fact that it's $79 on AppSumo right now, as well as it doesn't have webhook support currently, the reporting needs to be improved, uh, the download file, that just doesn't really work. When you're capturing an email, it's not going anywhere right now other than that Excel sheet. There's things like that that make this tool more or less either a buy and hold or you're gonna have to embed them on your site and incorporate them in your other workflows. Hopefully this video brought you some value. My name is Scott with AI Profits and I'll see you in the next one.